Hello everyone. In this video, I will make a model of a Nike bottle using Illustrator and Adobe Dimensions. First, I'm going to Google for a suitable picture of a bottle. Very cool. I would choose this looks beautiful. Let's save it in the original project file. I will start with Adobe Illustrator CC 2022. Choose the dimensions that fit. To fetch the image, choose File, then Place. I'll lock the layer to ensure it doesn't move while drawing. But before I start drawing, I will do some simple steps. I will put a guide in the middle of the picture. I also split the image horizontally. Thank you for being with me so far, don't forget to click like. If you get any benefit, subscribe to the channel. And activate the bell to receive all new tutorials to come. See you soon. Now from the middle of the picture, I start drawing. I'll choose a different color, let it be red. Let's hide the guides. We also hide the original image layer. Choose the color gray. From effect, choose 3D materials, you are revelable. From Revolve choose Front. And here we may have obtained the same shape as in the original image. We are making some adjustments to the corners and edges. The file can now be exported in OBG format.
and that was done from the window, then asset expand. We choose the file name 3D Bottle Nike. And from here we choose OBJ. Select the item. Choose Expand. We are making some modifications to the model. From choosing the color, materials, and lighting. Export the file in JPG format. Now from Adobe Dimensions. We make the mockup for the anthropomorphic and add the logo. From the file, choose import then 3D model. From the material icon, we choose the appropriate material. We change the color to black. From here I get the logo. The logo is in PNG format. We move in zoom in and out until it is in the right place.
From here we do a rendering to see what the final look will look like. And this is a fast renderer. And at any time you can change the materials to any one you choose. It looks nicer and closer to the original picture. Also, the luster in it is clear. Now that we have finished adjusting the shape, we will make a final render. From here from render. We name the project. Choose the save file. Select the PSD export option. We choose high quality and slow. Then choose render. Wait a little while before it's finished. Open the PSD file with Adobe Photoshop. Here is my final product. Thank you for being with me so far, don't forget to click like. If you get any benefit, subscribe to the channel. And activate the bell to receive all new tutorials to come. See you soon.